one gram of salt is the difference for millions of heart attacks. We know consuming too much salt raises blood pressure, which in turn can lead to cardiovascular problems. A 2022 study has quantified this relationship as a public health message in clear, stark terms. Looking at health data on adults in China, the study authors estimate that a reduction of just one gram in daily salt intake would be enough to prevent 9 million cases of stroke and heart attack between now and 2030. With 4 million of those cases likely to be fatal, such a simple measure could save a lot of lives. In China, average daily salt consumption sits at 11 grams, way above the 5 grams recommended by World Health Organization, WHO. The researchers pulled together the latest stats on population size, salt consumption, blood pressure, and disease rates. Previous estimations of the health impact of reducing salt intake in China used either obsolete or otherwise unreliable data sources and did not account for the more prolonged effect of salt reduction in, on blood pressure over several years, write the researchers with their, uh, in their published paper. The team looked at two other scenarios besides a single gram drop, a reduction of 3.2 grams per day, a 30% drop from the average by 2025, and reducing salt intake to the recommended 5 grams per day by the year 2030. If those targets are hit, up to twice as many deaths related to cardiovascular disease could be prevented due to the estimated reduction in systolic blood pressure. However, the researchers emphasized that the reduction would have to be consistent over several years. Education programs run in China school, Chinese schools suggest most of the population would not find it too difficult to hit that one gram per day target. Other trials on low sodium, high potassium salt substitutes, health education to home cooks and restaurants interventions are ongoing or have recently been completed some of which have already shown promising results, write the researchers. Cardiovascular disease accounts for a massive 40% of deaths in China, with urbanization and the associated increase in eating processed and takeaway foods thought to be one of the main contributing factors. And while the authors of the study looked at a potential reduction in cases of cardiovascular disease, they suggest that lowering salt intake would have multiple other benefits too, too much salt has also been linked to certain types of cancers and varied kidney problems, for example. The Chinese government has launched a Healthy China 2030 campaign to try to hit this target of a daily salt intake of just 5 grams. That won't be easy with a population of 1.4 billion people, but the numbers produced in the study are compelling. A salt reduction program that is workable, coherent, sustainable, and targeting current and upcoming major dietary sources of salt in China is urgently needed, write the researchers. The research was uh, published in the BMJ Nutrition, Prevention and Health, and this is on Science Alert by David Neald. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Please support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.